Hello, we're on here again, and it's getting closer and closer to me now. Uh, fixed up as it is where it was, will be. Anyway, so this is a quick note. Uh, it's me, you know, I do just kind of um, AA type recovery, and uh, part of it is to um, to have the teacher art class there, which I think the person she had just let me uh, do that just to, uh, you know, to help with my mental recovery. And so then I started getting these books and so forth. And as I said, you know, there's, uh, there's this uh, deal where you go there. There's no real, there's no rhyme or reason to it. And it's just a thing that they do where they give away the books. And people just go there. And if you're doing homeschooling, then you put down your, your, own, your address. Which means, really, you don't have to be, you know, a school. You don't have to be a, a teacher. And the, the, my, my boss there, she has her doctorate in education, you know, PhD doctor, so-and-so, you know. Uh, which is really professor, professora, you know, the, the, the correct uh, English, which would be really um, not English, English, but European English rather than um, American English. In Eng American English, we say doctor if you have your doctorate. So I would be doctor, you know, uh, we don't, or actually doctor, you know, <laughs> Smith, Dr. Smith, Zachary Smith, in terms of the medical doctor. And um, oddly enough, um, June. What's her name? Anyway, so she plays the doctor, and then, and then she plays, uh, I can't remember, she's, anyway, I can't remember the actress's name, but she plays the Swiss family Robinson's, uh, the wife of the, of the, you know, the, the mother of the family, and she's the doctor also, and Dr. Smith is also a doctor, and so, uh, the, uh, the movie is just far darker and, and basically grisly, and it's a more, basically, uh, a gore, a gory, and a gore and horror story rather than some pure sci fi, which is alright. But this, this variables, and then if you know zombies, you wouldn't have a zombie film with a lot of gore and, uh, and, 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 and chomping and biting and stuff. And of course, Misfits, uh, you know, this is their zombie version. And finally, after like four, three seasons, you know, 97 episodes, it's very cool because they don't, they don't have the, uh, the mandatory like 25 episodes and the sweep, sweep kind of stuff. They just, just do things. So. Anyway. Grape juice. Mm. Anyway, so uh, actual grape juice. Mm. No, no wine. It's good. Three and a half years. So nice. Uh, anyway, so I was gonna say, um, there's this thing though that you know, just way odd. But you know, it's like, and, and, you, and you sort of see where people, they, they, you know, they, they do something for your favor, and then there's always something expected. Okay, where's when's the shoe gonna fall when the when the other, you know boot going to the boot boot as I say. Um, like to secure uh, uh, Ruby's Hagrid, I'm sorry, uh, Robbie Coltrane plays Ruby as Hagrid, uh, so the, 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 you know, and, you know, it's a boot and boot, and then it's running because it's vowels and stuff. And of course you have the, uh, the R, or, or, and they have the, you know, like, René Descartes, and so I can't do the dry R, the French R, so forth. And then of course you have vowels and consonants, and then, you know, lach, and so forth, and lach, and then uh, R, or, or, er. Anyway, um, so it's just this idea that here's this whole resource, and Ken Jimmery, who founded Half Life Books, which I mean, obviously I've really loved books, and then his his, uh, his his friend, and, and, and she's sort of continuing on this work. I understand the, the, the politics and the positions. But anyway, so anyway, so he's passed on. He was actually one of the times Man of the Year, Person of the Year, Human of the Year, and Machine of the Year actually too. You know, episode of Thomas, we're sort of getting an iRobot kind of thing. <clears throat> Two episodes of our, the, the Will Smith, excellently done, good twist, good things. Um, Amy Cromwell is the head of uh, US, uh, U.S. Robotics. And then uh, I forget the lady who plays uh, Dr. Calvin. Uh, and so she uh, sort of a very, you know, because, anyway, so, but as I'm off writing, as, as off does, so. Anyway, um, um, that's pretty much Janet Asimov also wrote, uh, sort of a based on the idea of, of personality and the few mind and machine, so. Anyway, and so going back to this idea that it's this process that they do, and they, they have books and they're fantastic, and it's, you know, it's a pretty good thing. I've been sitting doing it, I just, just, you know, get my best pass. And I, I turned over, um, Helen Dale. You can imagine. Uh, just now, three years ago, when I could barely walk, and I had a walker and just barely to uh, 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 curbs. So at least just, you know, I fell down about like 
once or once or twice a month, a month or so. And I was trying not to do that, obviously. It was no fun. And, um, so, um, here's this idea that somebody has wanted to go get the books, and this person's an art person, and I've been, uh, giving, and when people come to the art, they get, they get a few parts and components, and they tend to buy the cheapest thing possible. They buy crayons are fine, crayons are good, I love crayons, but you know, they don't really buy any, uh, you know, just even chin on really good chalk. And then, uh, this is back, of course, you know, to my own training when I was uh, taking the classes at, uh, uh, Texas Teach College for many, many years ago. And, um, <clears throat> and so the monster idea was that people would say it's for children, it doesn't have to be very good. And her position was it's sort of, it had to be extra. And so that idea. Uh, and children tell is, um, uh, uh, to interview Christopher Huston about when he was to be on uh, to revitalize the, the version of uh, after Magan uh, anyway, Magan, Magan began the, the actor that made the Daku movie to this long hiatus from Mr. McCoy and Duff yes, the, his interest and so then the, the TV series, the UK series, the B, BBC as it's known went for it. So, I so Eckman who trying to really push this through and just really pour everything he did into both the quirky, usual Doctor Who, you know, the fashion of uh, uh, Doctor Who, which is more like a Doctor, if you took a picture, he's more like Doctor you know, he's more just a uh, Doctor, yes, I think there's a Doctor McCoy, so I think there's a thing, so this where uh, both Herc and, and Spock and the, the trainer, they're ill, and so they do the ship, of course, and then McCoy says, Quiet! You know, I mean, it's said really so. What do you know? I finally got the last word. And it's like, cool. So he's sort of the, the conscious, the soul, and the emotional center, of course, Spock is the rational of the center, and they this, they form this, and they have the theory to have of almost all this thing, and I'm so sensitive you pull thing you want to do. And, uh, if you didn't, I think you don't want to tell them before you start that intimacy thing. And so, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, Speechless way. 